Hi, it's me again with Corel Draws Tips and Tricks. And one of my subscribers sent me this clip art. And one way you can tell when you open it up that he's, it's not mine is it's in millimeters. But at least he's got his offset in zero. and So I'm not going to change it because I'm going to send it back to him. But he was having trouble uh, doing an outline on this object. And you can see the weld tool's not there. Nothing's going to happen. And the lines were too thick. He wanted to be able to cut it out. So all I did, and I've already done it for him, but I, he wanted to know how I did it. So I thought I'd, I'm mainly making this video for him, but you're going to learn a little bit, hopefully, too. So click on your item and just go up to this X, which is no fill, and click your left mouse button. Then go down and hit your right mouse button, and you can see it's got two lines. It's not one line. It's two lines, so that's the problem. You can go up to a range and break the curve apart. Now, he wanted just an outline, so we're going to take the smaller one and just get rid of it. And that also got rid of this little funny part. Now, all these lines aren't equal. Uh, as you can see, they're not part of the deal. But they are little circles, and they are lines. Where these are broken lines. So I don't really know what he wants to do with those. But you could go through there, and if you wanted that leaf and you wanted it engraved and not um, cut out you would just change it from a hairline make it black and then make it and I don't know what one millimeter is but that looks pretty good and then you could do the same thing to the rest of them and what you could do and because he doesn't have I don't know what his nudge factor is in millimeters we're going to change his nudge factor well it's 100 millimeter let's try this Let's just move our leaf out of the way two notches. Then we can group all these together. They have no outline color. We'll go up to black and we'll make them all one millimeter. So now they're all kind of same even though those are, these are filled in. So you just you could just unfill them. And now they're all the same. So these are just not circles where this is a completed shape. So I don't know what he wants to do with that. So we're going to click this back over to, and now we're back where we started. Now he did say he wanted to be able to cut this out. So very easily you could do, you could do it either way, a couple of ways, but take that shape and go up to effects, contour. And I don't know what two millimeters would be too much, but let's go. 0 0.05 hit apply that's not enough let's make it a little bigger hit apply and that that's probably big enough so I actually went to the inside I didn't want to do that I want to go to the outside whatever that was two millimeters so let's say that's good so then you go up to arrange break contour group apart I'd go ahead and make this a red hairline just so you'll know. So just go up and make it red. And then he can take this interior. And you can always kind of tell which one you're clicked on. See down here at the bottom we have a curve on layer. And let's say it's 240 millimeters. Well, let's see what the outside one is. It's 243, so it's just a little bit bigger. So if you want to know if you're on the inside one, your smaller number. So let's change that. Let's say he wants to engrave that and let's make it that same one millimeter and make it black. Now this will engrave and cut out just barely ab above beyond the leaf. Now there's, you don't really have to do that. You could actually have the cut line right on the line. You wouldn't have to contour. But I don't know what his plans are, but his plans are to put it in a circle and, and write a name on it and probably put it in this 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 area. So he can put a, it's for a classroom. They're going to put the, I don't know, the room number or whatever. But anyway, when you get into problems of a clip art and it won't do anything, you know, try breaking it apart and take the outline, the fill away, and then you'll see that it has two lines. Hope that helped a little bit and thank you for watching.